everybody, Gina here. I um, wanted to talk to you tonight about a neat little device that I found um, through B&B &B Hobbies in Brandon, Florida. Actually, I didn't find it through them. I found it online, but it's called the Scorpion Backup Guard. Now, what this is, it's a two-cell LiPo battery pack uh, with a little switch on it. It's got a one-way little diode in there. It's a one-way directional current flow. But what this thing does is it will you plug it into your receiver any open port on the receiver if you're using a, an external BEC on your nitro machine and what this does is if your BEC happens to fail during flight or your battery pack dies anything happens that uh, causes your receiver to lose power this little thing right here will sense that and it will automatically send 5 volts uh, power to your receiver to keep your electronics running. I have one installed on my Synergy N5. This one is for my 600N. This one's not installed yet because I need a couple of little uh, Y connectors and a, a couple of other little cords to hook this one up to the other helicopter. But I'll show you how this thing works now. Um, turn on my my transmitter here and get it get it uh, going. All right, I'm going to go ahead and turn my helicopter on. This is my on and off switch. So when I pull that out, it automatically fires my electronics up. Okay, now I did not turn on the uh, the uh, backup guard quite yet. What you do is you turn on the electronics of the uh, helicopter and then you reach back here and then you turn this on. Electronics on first, backup guard on last. Um, otherwise, if you turn this on first, it's going to power your electronics up and it's going to defeat the purpose. While this thing is off, when after you power on the uh, electronics, you turn this thing off, it will not draw unless it detects that the receiver is not getting um, at least 5 volts power. Okay, now, say you're flying around. I've got com complete control of my helicopter. Okay, now let's say my BEC fails or my battery comes unplugged or something crazy like that. So I'll turn it off to simulate that. Okay, when I put that back in now, my BEC just died. I got nothing, right? The helicopter comes crashing down. It's all over. Okay, so let me uh, reboot my, my uh, transmitter there and I'll turn this back on. Let the let the beast X uh, boot itself up, and then we'll then we'll turn on the uh, the uh, backup guard here, and then I'll uh, show you what would happen in the event of a uh, BC failure or power failure to the um, to the receiver. And okay, it's booted up. Now we're going to reach back here and uh, find that switch. Turn it on. Okay, it's on now, so it's it's ready to go. All right. Got full control of my helicopter. Everything's working. Now, my BEC fails. Now watch this. When I turn off the BEC, it's going to stay on because when this backup guard detects that it's going to, it's not getting power anymore, it just that fast sends power to it. Look at that. I turned it off. The backup guard took over. And I still have full control of my helicopter. Pretty neat little gadget. Um, the ReadyHeli.com should have these things in in a couple more weeks, or you can uh, get them uh, from B&B Hobbies in in Brandon, Florida. Uh, he has them in stock now. But nice little uh, cheap insurance deal here. These things are only $25. So if you're running an external BC on your nitro machine. It's a good little piece of equipment to have. Um, I'm glad I got these things. I'm not going to ever run my helicopters without this again. Um, but there you have it. Uh, when you go to turn the helicopter off, uh, you would take and uh, you would turn uh, the the backup guard off uh, last. So or first actually. You no, know, you turn the backup guard off first and then turn the uh, BEC off. Uh, that's what it says in the, in the instruction manual anyway. But um, it's, it's a really cool little, little deal there. It'll keep, you, it'll keep your machine alive in, in the event of a, uh, a power failure to your, 
see your receiver. It's it's well worth the $25. I'm going to go ahead and turn it off and see I turn it off and, and my electronics go off. So that's it. Um, that's all I wanted to show you. I'm going to unplug my battery here. And uh, like I said, the, the uh, Scorpion Backup Guard, $25 to save a $2,000 machine is well worth it. Um, just thought I'd share that with you. Um, thanks for watching.